as well i call it the random chord exercise so all you have to do <clears throat> is take a piece of paper write down as many chords as you can perhaps 10 15 15 is what i have done for this example if you want to make it even more random ask a friend to do it as i have done now uh, and once you have those chords on a piece of paper try and play them as fast as you can and as swiftly as you can with using the appropriate chord inversion so this is like the ultimate way to test your chord inversion knowledge your hand has to be on one position and all the chords have to just flow in that zone so <clears throat> this is a very real real world way of approaching chord inversions most of the other exercise uh, exercise which i talked about can be planned can be practiced but this one's very real time if you ask me so the chords i have here uh, are very random as you can see uh, f sharp minor b flat e they are not very musically related they are not even part of the same scale and that's the point to make it as random as possible so <clears throat> just look at them in front of you play the root note of those chords in your left hand and uh, figure out the appropriate inversions in the right hand and again get musical see if you can possibly add a melody to that uh, strange chord progression it may turn out well uh yeah so here's how it will sound <clears throat> 